dozens of young adults gathered in Phoenix to learn how to make positive differences in their communities. Reporter Emily Richardson attended the Obama Foundation's first Community Leadership Corps program to learn more about how it is helping empower young leaders in society. This weekend, the Obama Foundation held their first Community Leadership Corps, where they are teaching young activists organizing and leadership skills to help them enact change in their communities. And I realized that the best way for me to have an impact is to train the next generational leaders so that I can pass the baton and all of you can make change in your communities, in the country, and across the world. This weekend, the Obama Foundation started their Community Leadership Corps, which was designed to empower and train young leaders to create the world they want to live in by addressing issues in their communities. We need the next generation to show us how community involvement is going to work in the 21st century. The program is six months long and teaches young adults skills they need to be leaders, while allowing them to organize their own community outreach programs. Ashton Skinner and Brianna Combs are just two of the participants who hope to spark change in Phoenix. Skinner wants to create an online database with resources for the transgender community. So that people know what their rights are here, people know what the roadblocks are to um, social and legal transition and medical transition, and so that people in the trans community don't feel like they have to dig for these things themselves because that's a lot of work. And Combs wants to make Phoenix more sustainable. We need to build an environment where we're able to, you know, everybody has the same opportunity to grow and to learn and to live a happy and safe life. The foundation will be holding two more kickoff events this month in South Carolina and Illinois. In Phoenix, Emily Richardson, Cronkite News.